Hey guys, just sharing a quick video on a 2010-2011 Nissan Altima doing a rad drain, coolant drain, I don't know, uh, simple stuff though. Uh, I'll show you down here where it is. Always remember to be safe, use jack sands. Um, double support in case it wants to fall, it has something to land on so it doesn't fall on you. But yeah, simple. On the passenger side, if you come under here, it's right there. Uh, it's a little Phillips head screw um, plug. Hold on a second. Like that. Just unscrews left loose. Um, this one, I believe, is missing the skirt or the shroud for here that covers here. I don't know if it has one or not, but if yours has one, you're going to have to take it off or if, if you have access to get to that. Um, not sure not positive I'm lucky enough I this one came in with nothing on it so yeah I'm doing some work on an oil cooler back there oil cooler leak check out my video on that once I get to it uh, but there's lots of videos on it anyway on how to get that apart and what's going on there but yeah that's a rad drain coolant leak whatever you want to call it on a 2010 2011 Nissan Altima and yeah be careful when you're pulling that plug it's gonna come out all the coolant will just come flying out and get everywhere. Um, I believe you could loosen it and get it to like drip out like that, but mine just fell out. I, it's really short on the uh, on the threads. Comes out pretty easy, but yeah, simple stuff. 2010, 2011 Nissan Altima. Um, I believe it's a four cylinder. Not positive on the what liter is it? What, what liter it is? But yeah. If yours looks like this, it should be the same. 2010-2011 Nissan Altima. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe.